A former elementary school teacher has found a unique way to get around town while getting a workout. You might have seen him skating around downtown Panama City. As News 13's Emma Riley tells us, he says it allows him to spend less time in the gym and more time outside. When he's not paddling in the ocean, former first grade teacher Chad Wallace is paddling the streets of downtown. I usually get a lot of people going, oh, that's really neat. That's so cool. Did you make that? Wallace started skating about 10 years ago. After seeing an advertisement, he found a way to mix his two loves, paddleboarding and longboarding. It's like surfing. It's like paddleboarding. It's like riding a wave. It's very, very similar, especially when you go fast. It's very smooth. You can learn to uh, cut and maneuver. It's very, very smooth. And it helps him deal with all that life brings. I would say my lifestyle is just kind of let, let free, let go, um, spend the money you have. <laughs> um, because, you know, you, there's nothing promised. So um, definitely get out in the sun, sweat, stay, stay uh, healthy for sure, um, and be extremely kind and friendly to everybody. After skating around downtown for the last nine years, Wallace says he hasn't met another person in town that also land paddles. He often gets comments while he's riding around and people will say things like, It's really cool or that's the best thing I've ever seen or wow, it's a great idea or oh, I want one or oh, I want to get on there, you know. So I always, if I see someone who wants to get on, I say jump on. Wallace says he'd love to create a club one day to skate around downtown like this. I would love it. I think it's so great uh, from from the youngest to the oldest, I would love it. He says it's a great way to bond with his kids and they often ride alongside of him. Me being a first grade teacher for all my years, I've just learned that, you know, golly, this, I mean, we all should be like children in a way. We should be very calm and easy and not worry so much. He says everyone should find something therapeutic that relaxes them for at least an hour a day, whatever that may be. In Panama City, Emma Riley, News 13, Panhandle Strong.